subscribe to this is KSTG channel and uh, press that bell icon to watch all my latest videos before anyone else. Yo guys, what's up? This is Kunal Singh aka KSTG here guys and today I am showing you how you can make any of your Android phone look exactly like Galaxy Note 8. So as you could see that's my uh, Xiaomi Redmi 4. It's not a hi-fi smartphone. It's just a phone that costs 10,000 rupees. It's under 10,000 4 GB RAM 64 GB ROM variant. So as you could see guys you would be shocked now to see this UI. You should be thinking that it's uh, the icons and everything is it's like Samsung Galaxy Note 8 so that's what today I'm making video about guys this video is today is about how you can make your any Android phone look like Samsung Galaxy Note 8 so let's get started So guys you should be thinking how this phone is looking like that how this phone is looking like noted even this swipe up gesture and this screen this menu I know you could see it's looking exactly like noted so it's a launcher guys it's a note 8 launcher its name is note 8 launcher let me show you there it uh, there in the menu where it is man there it is note 8 launcher there as you could see that's the logo let me show you you could go and download this app guys from the description from the play store let me show you where it is on the play store when you will click that link it will take you up here into note 8 you could also simply search note 8 launcher on play store and it will take you up here so here is this app it is asking as you could see it is saying uninstall and update so that means that it is note 8's launcher guys so as you could see it has got 4.7 rating on the play store and 1 million downloads have been done till now so it is a really really great app guys i would really recommend you to download it up man it has really great features like uh, this whenever you will click on an app it will show you some features like this like edit app info gestures you could even put some gestures for this any app and you could even remove it using this function and there it is this clock thing something like this you could even resize it or you could even remove it from your home screen and you should be thinking this effect while while uh, swiping through the home screen how it is coming it is a samsung original thing how this effect is coming on your phone you all should be thinking so for that you would have to hold down on any of your screens on which or on whichever screen you are in this launcher and you would have to go oh guys my camera is getting f out of focus you would have to click on this note setting that will take you here into this settings option of this launcher there guys in the desktop option you would have to in this transition effect option it again got man it again got uh, out of focus my camera so here you would have to select galaxy style it will show you a lot of styles but you will have to select this galaxy style here and and there guys you it will show you a lot of options like height status bar and everything even icon size icon color style to select wallpaper android 4.4 style so guys it will show you something like this even you can enable infinite scrolling and there is an option to enable swipe from the first screen to the right to get the google now screen so it is great man this launcher is really really great so guys now i just uh, updated this uh, launcher guys so it's now ha uh, have been a bit changed uh, the icons are now completely covered there are no white bezels around them i just updated it 2 mb update it was and uh, my camera is getting a bit out of focus guys so you can see the white bezels are now a bit reduced around those icons 
and everything is there guys everything is there even this unread icon unread count on whichever thing you use like if you use gmail there will be an any unread count also and you could even increase the size of this of the wall that used to come here let me get it back from the widgets in the widgets where is that clock where is that clock man so guys whenever you will have if you mistakenly remove uh, an item like i had just removed uh, that clock that analog clock mistakenly so that so now i can add it uh, using this edit option in there i can go into this widgets option and there is this analog clock i can choose the theme of it i can choose this one also or choose this one also let's choose this one this time i don't know how it gets up there yeah yeah as you could see there there it is it is like this one too you can add that one clock the earlier one also like this but i prefer this one now it is looking great one so now let's get back to the features that i was telling you about in of this launcher there in the drawer option here also you could select the drawer style how you want it to come up like i have selected vertical and you can even select if you want that az on the right side and if you want to have recent apps option on the top and guys there you could also enable infinite scrolling i would recommend you to enable that and guys here in the unread counter you could enable all these options man it won't require it is saying that it will require you to get a prime uh, app prime version of this app it is requiring it is saying that it will require you to get that prime version of this app but if you turn it on man it will get activated without getting that prime version so and in this theme and i, I in this theme and ui icon pack you can even select the animation of the scroll speed and the i have selected scroll sp scroll speed of the menu as fast and animation speed i have kept on default and you could even select the ui mode like i have selected the medium one if i select small size it will become small like this it has become smaller now as you could see it has become smaller now as you could see the icons are small now compared to our compared to the earlier icons and then now let me put it back to medium and now let's see what happens as you could see it has came back on the original size so you can do these tweaks according to your needs and uh, you there are some gestures also swipe up swipe down you could even configure them swipe up i have selected to get the app drawer like the as the like the original samsung galaxy note 8 and in the advanced option you can even select these options import option import desktop layout from another launcher that is great man even you could enable the charging screen there and uh, do remember to turn this option on keep in memory so that this launcher doesn't get closed it will kept on running in the background so you can use it and there in the theme and ui option you can even scan fonts whichever fonts you have in your phone it will scan all the fonts that are present in your phone and you could select from them whichever font you want i have selected one of the fonts from my pixart application the font that i like it is really really great guys it is now scanning for the fonts it is scanning for all the fonts that is present in my phone right now so as you could see it's scanning all the apps which has some fonts in it so it has scanned i think yeah and then if you click on this select font option you can select from a lot of fonts and it will be applied into your uh, launcher that font will be your default font as you could see i have this font it is from my application pixart pixart this application you could download to get that font and you would be asking me how you got that wallpaper i i you can download an app called note it launcher another one 
you could download that app in from the play store it is in the play store let me show you it is in the play store it is with the note 8 launcher itself let me click on that and in the in the play store there it is this one this store to go this store to go application this one or this one i think this one is it yeah yeah this one you could download this one only to get that wallpaper when you got that wallpaper up just uninstall it up and you would get this wallpaper here like this with infinite scrolling let me silent my phone up so guys and whenever you will slide right you could enable that option to get google now when you slide right swipe right but i have enabled this option to get this bar this notification toggle you could say and here is all the volumes of media and everything i have and yeah you can even free up your ram from here and you there will be your favorite apps you five apps are already there five you can add from yourself so guys that was about it man it is a great note 8 launcher man uh, the speed of it is fast the apps gets launched really fast and the icons are completely taken up from the note 8 exactly they are exactly like you have in the note 8 and this application when this apps comes this is also great man in there you could get this application this uh, this animation from this drawer option yeah yeah there it is this transition option zoom this option is mainly that you could get that thing that animation when you open up the menu like this this you can get from the settings easily so guys there it is this note 8 launcher you could download it from the description it is great man and there is a new thing came in this uh, launcher after update after updating it whenever you will click on an app now the options are gonna come in its color like in the color of that icon completely like i am clicking on whatsapp it's gonna come in green color because whatsapp's icon is green colored and whenever i will click hold touch and hold on youtube it will the options are gonna come in red color and when i will hold on on chrome it will gonna come in a yellowish or grayish type of thing and there if i take this out also and if yeah as you could see it is also in yellow color of this let me put it back let me get this navigation option out and let's click on that and you could see it is kind of a blue so it is according to the icons color and man it's really great it is a really really great note 8 launcher man completely it can make your phone look a lot like note 8 even there are some shortcuts like torch camera calls and everything even wi-fi and data options are there you can even turn on your torch using that option there it is so yeah you can turn on your torch also from this option there is another option also there guys that i missed out on man i completely forgot about that there is that note toolbox also from the edit man let me get it about out there it got on there low oh, shit so this note toolbox has very much tools like note boost app manager data manager note help you could learn from here how to get it everything you can learn how to get every widget out and everything let me skip quit that and there you could even get this rounded corner this is the main thing man if you enable it you can get the rounded corners like the note 8 actually has and it will be enabled in every application you would open it will completely feel like you are running a note 8 it is also a great feature man you could enable it from the note toolbox there it is and you could even select the radius of the of this rounded corner so you could even get it man like this the radius you can even change the radius of it man like this you can change the radius i have set it to 22 because it looks great so i just forgot to mention this feature 
and and, and I'm mentioning it right now in the between. And also, man, you can even uh, adjust the gestures, man, gestures and those uh, swipe up or those uh, speed, the speed of the drawer, like like I have did into th in this video earlier, like I did that. There in the theme and UI pa icon pack, you can adjust this scroll speed so that whenever you scroll through the menu, you could get good speeds of scrolling. I like to prefer it fast so that so that I could find my apps faster. So yeah. So guys, it is a great launcher. Do download it from the link in the description, man. And do drop a like to this video if you enjoy. If you thought that this could be the next noted experience launcher completely. And man, do subscribe to my channel for more awesome techie videos like this one. I would be coming with more awesome videos like this one. So stay tuned, man. This is KSTG here, guys. Really this time signing out. Peace. Bye-bye. And take care.